The Su-35S Flanker E is one of Russia's most advanced and lethal multirole fighter aircraft, designed for air superiority and deep strike roles. Developed by Suhoi, the Su-35S is an evolution of the Su-27 platform, featuring extensive upgrades in avionics, engines, weaponry, and stealth characteristics. While maintaining the aerodynamic excellence of its predecessor, the Su-35S incorporates fifth-generation capabilities that bridge the gap between older fourth-generation fighters and true stealth aircraft like the Su-57. This fighter is powered by two Saturn AL-41F1S afterburning turbofan engines, each generating up to 31,900 pounds of thrust with afterburner. These engines enable the Su-35S to reach speeds of Mach 2.25 and achieve supercruise capability under certain conditions. With a combat radius of approximately 1,600 km and a ferry range exceeding 3,600 km with drop tanks, the Su-35S has the endurance for long-range missions without the need for frequent refueling. It also features in-flight refueling capability, allowing it to extend its operational envelope significantly in both defensive and offensive operations. What sets the Su-35S apart is its extreme maneuverability, a hallmark of Russian fighter design. This aircraft features a digital fly-by-wire control system and thrust vectoring nozzles, granting it unrivaled agility in dogfights. The vectoring system allows the Su-35S to perform advanced aerial maneuvers, such as the Pugachev's Cobra and the Culbit, giving it an edge in close-range engagements by allowing it to quickly change orientation and evade missiles or gain firing positions. The Su-35S features an advanced Urbis-E passive electronically scanned array PESA, radar system, which provides long-range detection and tracking of airborne and ground targets. The Urbis-E radar can detect airborne targets up to 400 kilometers away and track up to 30 targets simultaneously while engaging up to 8 of them. It also includes synthetic aperture radar SAR, modes for ground mapping and target identification. The radar is complemented by an infrared search and track IRST, system called OLS-35, which provides passive target detection without emitting signals that can be tracked by enemy sensors. In terms of avionics, the Su-35S boasts a digital glass cockpit with two large multifunction LCD displays, a wide-angle head-up display, and a helmet-mounted target designation system. These systems give the pilot situational awareness and the ability to engage targets without direct visual contact. The aircraft also includes an electronic warfare EU suite that provides radar jamming, threat detection, and countermeasure deployment, enhancing survivability in contested airspace. The Su-35S has 12 hardpoints, allowing it to carry up to 8,000 kilograms of ordnance. It is compatible with a wide variety of Russian air-to-air, air-to-ground, and air-to-sea munitions. For air superiority missions, the Su-35S carries long-range R-77 and R-37M missiles, medium-range R-27 variants, and short-range R-73 missiles with off-borazite capability. For ground attack, it can be equipped with guided bombs like the CAB-500 series and missiles such as the KH-29, KH-38, and KH-59. For anti-ship roles, the Su-35S can deploy KH-31A or KH-35 cruise missiles, making it a versatile platform capable of challenging both aerial and surface threats. The internal GSH-31 30mm cannon with 150 rounds adds to the Su-35S's lethality in close-range combat. Despite the aircraft's large size and heavy payload, its thrust-to-weight ratio and flight control systems make it capable of fighting with high maneuverability, even when fully loaded. This makes the Su-35S a threat to both Western fourth-generation fighters and potentially even some fifth-generation platforms under specific tactical conditions. The Su-35S also incorporates features aimed at reducing its radar cross-section (RCS), including radar absorbent materials, recontoured air intakes, and minimized surface gaps. While not a true stealth aircraft, these enhancements make it harder to detect and track than previous Su-27 derivatives. Combined with its powerful sensors and long-range weapons, this gives the Su-35S a first look, first shoot capability under certain scenarios. Operationally, the Su-35S is deployed with the Russian Aerospace Forces and has seen combat use in Syria. In that theater, the aircraft was used to escort bombers, conduct air superiority missions, and provide air cover for ground operations. Its long-range, endurance, and multi-role capability proved valuable in projecting Russian air power and demonstrating the platform's effectiveness in real-world conditions. The combat experience gained in Syria also contributed to software and hardware improvements for subsequent production batches. The export potential of the Su-35S is significant. 
China was the first foreign customer, acquiring 24 aircraft under a $2.5 billion deal. Indonesia followed with an order for 11 aircraft, although that deal was reportedly impacted by pressure from the United States under CAATSA sanctions. Several other nations have expressed interest in the Su-35S due to its cost-effectiveness relative to Western competitors, its multi-role capability, and the political advantage of non-alignment with NATO defense systems. Despite its capabilities, the Su-35S faces challenges in modern air warfare, particularly in facing stealth fighters like the F-22 Raptor or F-35 Lightning II. While the Su-35S has exceptional agility and sensors, it lacks the all-aspect stealth and full-data fusion capabilities of true fifth-generation jets. Its survivability in heavily contested environments with integrated air defenses and electronic warfare threats remains debated among analysts. However, in environments with limited stealth threats or where long-range missile engagements dominate, the Su-35S remains a formidable force. Another concern is the aircraft's reliance on Russian supply chains for maintenance and spare parts, which can be a vulnerability for export users in times of political instability or sanctions. Additionally, while the AL-41F1S engines are powerful, their time between overhauls is less than that of Western counterparts, adding to the logistical burden. The Su-35S's role in Russia's doctrine emphasizes both deterrence and dominance in regional conflicts. It can intercept high-speed aerial threats, penetrate deep into enemy territory, and support ground forces with precision strikes. Its versatility allows it to operate as a frontline fighter, a long-range interceptor, and a strike aircraft. In joint operations, Su-35S units are often tasked with protecting other assets, such as bombers or surveillance aircraft, while also being capable of solo missions. Looking ahead, the Su-35S may serve as a stopgap between the aging Su-2730 series and the more advanced Su-57 stealth fighter. It provides the Russian military with an aircraft that can operate with sophistication in modern conflict scenarios while being more affordable and mature than fifth-generation platforms. Some of the Su-35S's technology, including its engines and avionics systems, also feed directly into Su-57 development, showcasing its role in Russia's broader aerospace strategy. In summary, the Su-35S Flanker E is a high-performance, heavily armed, and versatile multirole fighter that represents one of the most capable fourth-generation plus aircraft in the world.